KSI versus Logan Paul was one of the biggest online events in history. Whether you're a fan of either of them or not, you can't deny that they put on one hell of a show. And just over one year later, KSI and Logan Paul have announced that they're going to be having a rematch this year in November. Me personally, I can't wait for this. I feel like JJ was a little bit hard done by last time. I say a little bit. I mean a lot, those judges did him dirty. But DAZN have literally just dropped a brand new trailer right now, so I'm gonna be reacting to that in this video and then giving some predictions on the fight and what I think is gonna go down in the rematch this time. The hype is coming back, ladies and gentlemen. I don't think you realize what you've walked into. Mark my words, that mother is going down. That face, man, Venom. A little bit scrappy, not gonna lie. I'm not gonna lie, that whole part did make it seem really scripted where they were like, I guess we have to do a rematch. Let's give the people what they want. As far as I'm aware, even though JJ was very hard done by, you know, the, the, the draw was the fair result in the judges' eyes, you know. Oh, damn. Okay. No head guard. Okay. Murder that dude, bro. <laughs> I finish you off. Damn. All right, so the fight is gonna be on Saturday the 9th of November in the Staples Center in Los Angeles. And I guess the big difference this time around is that Matchroom Boxing are gonna be the ones who are promoting this fight. And also, if I'm not wrong, Billy Joe Saunders is also on the main card in this fight, which is absolutely insane. Uh, it's, this is not just a YouTube event anymore. This is, you know, this is mainstream. But before we do jump into my predictions for this fight, I've been fortunate enough to be selected to show you guys a brand new game, one of the most ambitious RPG projects of 2019. This is a game called Raid Shadow legend and it's one of the most immersive experiences you're gonna find on a smartphone and it can only really be compared with PC and console titles and the best part about it is it's completely free. What makes this game so great is the amazing storyline, awesome 3D graphics, giant boss fights, PvP battles and hundreds of champions to collect and customize. Almost 10 million players worldwide have already downloaded this game and started playing in only three months which is Mad. So as you can see on the screen, my favorite champion is this guy here called Kale. Guy is just a badass. I mean, look at him. I've already been upgrading and customizing his weapons as well as his armor. And my favorite move is definitely this one you can see on the screen. Acid Rain. It's two targets. I mean, come on. This guy, this guy is just a total badass. Me personally, I enjoy playing PvP against other people. I like to know that what I'm doing is, you know, ruining their day when I beat them. But now, nah, personally, I really enjoy this game. But you don't have to only take my word for it. With more than 200,000 reviews, Raid has almost a perfect score on the Play Store. The game is growing super fast and you can see that by the roadmap that they've published showing updates that they've got coming out over the next six months and beyond. You can find me in the game under the nickname Randolph UK and if you're quick enough by clicking the link in the description you can come and join my clan and play with me. So what are you guys waiting for? Go and click the link in the description. It directly supports me. And also if you do use my links you get 50,000 silver and also a free epic champion as part of the new player program to get you up and running in the game and start your journey. So so Raid Shadow Legends, go and play the game and I'll see you in there. Okay, so we're back and it's time for my predictions for the KSI and Logan Paul fight. Thank you for sitting through that message real quick. Things like that do directly support me and help me to be able to make more videos that you guys enjoy and also put into funding my music videos and my music because obviously I do this independently. But anyway, my predictions for KSI versus Logan Paul 2. I'm not gonna lie, I'm definitely more nervous for this fight. Obviously, for those who don't know, I'm close to JJ, so I'm definitely going to be more biased towards him in this video. However, with that being said, I'm more nervous for this fight, mainly because of the fact that Logan is more of an athletic guy in terms of an all-rounder, if that makes sense. Don't get me wrong, JJ is really athletic himself, but Logan, to me, seems like the typical American, you know, wrestler, uh, athletic track type of guy. He can do anything sports-wise, and he'll probably be good at it or like at least somewhat and also the fact that Logan I feel like has been training more consistently than JJ since the last fight I feel like as soon as the last fight ended Logan was training back in the gym going hard whereas JJ took a different approach a lot of the time he was bulking obviously the, the memes and the jokes around it was him putting on weight but that was not just because he was eating crap it also was because he was trying to bulk so he can be heavier for this fight maybe he went a little bit too far who knows only he can answer that but what I will say is that JJ is super strong right now like the, the extra bulk has definitely helped him you know to to become stronger and boxing is obviously a very athletic game however it's not all about the all-round athleticism it's more about the boxing skill and your actual ability to throw punches and to counter 
I'm not a boxing guy myself, I don't know too much, but I've watched enough fights to know that it's not always the most fit and the most athletic guy who wins. Just look at the Anthony Joshua and Ruiz fight. It's more about what happens on the night and it's more about your technical boxing knowledge. And I feel that with Leon and Vidal training JJ, they're gonna give him what he needs to be able to win this fight. So I'm still very confident. I do think that JJ will go on to win this fight purely due to the, the boxing brain and also his just his pure strength. However, I am nervous in the sense that Logan has been going hard, training for a longer period of time. I'm always nervous for these things anyway. For the Joe Weller fight, I was dying. For the Logan fight, I was dying. And I can't imagine this time in LA is gonna be any different at all. But obviously I'm excited. I'm especially excited for my friend who's working with Matchroom Boxing, which is an insane uh, feat. It's gonna be a big, big, big fight in the boxing world, but also the YouTube world, and also just in online media. In general, I feel like this direction that we're going in is just insane and I'm so happy to be able to see it develop and flourish into this whole other medium of entertainment, really. Anyway, I wanna see what you guys think of this fight down in the comments. After you've played Raid Shadow Legends and let me know about the game, make sure you do let me know the predictions for this fight and also what you think about it in general. I'm interested to see. I'm sure Simon and I are gonna talk about this more on the What's Good podcast. This video today was just a way for me to First of all, show you guys about Raid Shadow Legends, but also just to give you my opinion, my quick thoughts and predictions on the fight, uh, and just show you guys the trailer, really. So I hope you did enjoy this video. I hope you're ready for more content coming soon. I've really enjoyed being back on YouTube. I feel like I've definitely upgraded my content since I've been back from tour, putting a lot more thought into the execution and the quality of the ideas. And hopefully I can keep going, take you guys with me, and we can build this awesome community. Anyway, like I said before, comment down below. Let me know your thoughts on the fight. Leave a like if you enjoyed the video. Subscribe if you're new around here. New music coming soon, I promise. Uh, and yeah, my name's been Randolph. I will see you guys on the next video. Peace.